Welcome everyone to the Tactical Tavern. My name is Tomas Alas and in this video we are reviewing the TKL Knives Raider Fixed Blade. This is a compact fixed blade designed for everyday carry and we're going to see if it has what it takes to earn the Tactical Tavern seal of approval. By the end of this review you'll have the necessary information to decide whether or not this is right for your everyday carry or next outdoor adventure. With that being said, let's cut into it. Before we begin, if you love gadgets gear and upgrading your everyday carry, take a moment to drop a like and subscribe for more content like this. So at the time of this review, you can find the Raider from TKL Knives for around $200. What's really unique about this knife is that it is a mid-tech knife, meaning there's a lot of hand assembling and finishing that goes into it, and it is not completely produced by a machine. Reading up on his website, Tim Kell is a Marine veteran who has a commitment to customer service and quality control. And what I like is that he has a lifetime warranty for his knives that includes sharpening. This knife comes in at 7.25 inches with a 3.25 inch blade comprised of 1095 high carbon steel. It also features a nickel boron clad coating that is wear resistant, but comes with a battle worn finish to prevent any scuffing or any damage to the knife. One of my favorite properties about this coating is that it is self lubricating and you'll notice that it doesn't stick when going through wood and it has very little resistance when slicing through food. The handle on this knife is black G10 that offers some texturized finish and a great grip that's comfortable for extended hard use cutting tasks. A really cool feature about TKL knives is that this handle configuration will fit on a variety of different other blade shapes. The handles are quite comfortable in forward grip. I've also found them great for doing some draw cuts. However, I do have to note that in reverse grip, it does have a little bit of a rounded point to it. And if you wanted to rock it in a picol style, which is a tip down edge in, it's not the most comfortable and has a little bit of a bite to the palm of the hand. But other than that, in a standard conventional grip, this thing will cut for days. I have been extensively testing this knife for months and you're gonna see a lot of that footage rolled in here. I've not touched this edge up since the time that I got it. And you can see here, there's a little bit of carbonization on that edge. It's 1095, it is a high carbon, but we're gonna do a paper cut test and show you that edge after months of use. Definitely not bad. I mean, when I got this thing, it was hair shaving sharp. And from all that abuse that I put this knife through, I'm quite impressed with that edge retention. This knife comes equipped with a Kydex sheath that also has a 1.5 inch belt attachment. Normally I'm a fan of the discrete carry concepts clips. However, I have to say that this clip actually worked quite well for horizontal carry. The eyelets and spacing allow you to put a variety of your favorite carry methods, such as IWB loops, the tech locks, and of course those discrete carry concepts clips. I really like how you can grab this knife out of the sheath very smoothly and has that increased jimping there to ensure that you get a positive deployment. You can see here where we made numerous feather sticks and it has enough weight behind the edge where you can use it for extended chopping as well. Another cool feature about the handle is that when you undo the back screw, it'll open it up and give you a lanyard hole so you can attach it to a spear or get some extra chopping power if you wanted to use it that way. Now, some things to take note on is that this knife weighs a little bit more than your average everyday carry fixed blade. It's 1095 and it is a chunk of it that comes down to a very cute edge. But for those of you that are into minimalist or lightweight backpacking, you may want to look elsewhere for your everyday carry blade. If you're into tools that are as tough as nails and offer reliable capability, I would highly recommend you take a look at TKL Knives. I'm looking forward to seeing what else that TKL Knives creates. And if you agree or disagree, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below, as well as what other everyday carry gear you'd love to see reviewed. If you found value from this video, make sure to drop a like, share, and subscribe because it helps grow the channel. While you're there, turn on post notifications so you are the first to know of new videos coming every Tuesday and Thursday. Also, take a moment to follow us on Instagram at Tactical Tavern to get a behind-the-scenes look at new gear, the testing process, and some fun videos you won't find here. With that being said, my name is Tomas Alas. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. And remember, be prepared, be practical, stay tactical.